Because of inflation, Caledonia schools need more money to finish projects approved by voters in 2020. That means voters are once again being asked to approve more money. News 8's Kyle Mitchell explains all new at 6. Funding for the bond will help replace and relocate Dutton Elementary. The superintendent says the district is outgrowing the building and has plans for a new school in a more suitable location. The growing cost of construction has Caledonia Community Schools asking for help. On average, we are looking in the neighborhood of 20 to 30 percent more than what we put to paper in 2019 when we developed the estimates for this original bond. The district proposed an $88 million bond in 2020, but some of the projects can't be completed without additional funding. Just like everyone is experiencing an enormous price hike at the gas station or the grocery store, that same price hike has come to the world of construction. And so what we quickly found is that we do not have the ability to stretch that money across everything that our community supported originally in 2020. Superintendent Diedrich Martin says the district is asking voters for a $61 million supplemental bond in the May election. They've already completed some of the building work funded through the original 2020 bond. We did some substantial renovations to Duncan Lake, which is one of our middle schools. We also did substantial additions and renovation to Craft uh, Meadows Intermediate School. One project that has not been completed is building and relocating Dutton Elementary. $40 million of the supplemental bond will go to the project. This school is over 60 years old. This school has had multiple add-ons, additions, and tweaks. Martin says the aging building is not big enough for the growing district. And the location itself is an issue. This is an elementary building that is in the heart of an industrial zone. Not appropriate for elementary schools anymore. The district already owns this property on Patterson Avenue near 76th Street and has plans to be in construction this fall if the bond is approved. The money will help in other areas. A community center which will include a high school competition pool with integrated diving wells for our high school students who have never had a home for their swim team. Election day is May 2nd. In Caledonia, Kyle Mitchell, News 8.